Because we've decided each Friday we want to celebrate good news stories. Feel Good Friday kind of thing, Maura. Yeah, we're going to celebrate, I suppose, people that represent all that is good about Ireland. Maybe people who hold nations in their hands or maybe, strictly speaking, their feet. Yes, that's exactly what I'm talking about. Maybe somebody live from London, maybe somebody live from the rehearsals of Strictly Come Dancing, hey. Mr. Daniel O'Donnell. Tough fall to Ruth. Tough fall to Ruth, Daniel. How are you doing? Lovely to see you. How are you getting on? Don't mind us. How are you getting on? You look chilled oh, anyway. I'm as nervous as hell. I might look chilled, but I'm not a bit chilled, I'm afraid. <laughs> Daniel, I've been listening to you because I know you were talking to Ray Darcy over the period of the build-up to the debut. And I have to say, really, I know you always say that you're kind of like, oh God, I'm unsure and I feel like I'm not great at the dances. But I actually think that you are going to be brilliant. Well, you know, we have done an awful lot of rehearsal and Christina is a brilliant teacher. And uh, it's just up to, I suppose, up to me now to try and settle my nerves and display some of what I learned. I'm sure none of us are going to be perfect as far as dancing is concerned, but it's been such a great experience so far. And um, obviously, people know now they're very strict. Strictly is definitely a good name. <laughs> and what we tell, what we don't tell. And it was only just a couple of days ago that they announced that we're all dan what we're all dancing. I'm doing a waltz, and I'm doing it to when Irish eyes are smiling. So there's well, a big suit you. there's a big Irish feel to it, you know. So it's really lovely, and um, I just hope it. it works out well and that it looks good and that I enjoy it as much as I want to. Daniel, Although you, you have been... So you, have, nervous, I don't know. you have been training for the last three weeks. What has the day-to-day -day training been like? What time are you in in the morning? How long do you train for every day? Well, we, we train about five or six hours a day. Um, it could be four, it could be six, you know. And we, we just go in in the, in the morning and, and there's cameras there for a couple of hours just watching what you're doing. And then, you know, you're left alone to, to rehearse. And it really is, is from beginning. I mean, prior to, to starting, if somebody said to me, can you dance? I would have been very cocky and say, yeah, I can dance all right. But I'll tell you. Were, you. you were dancing very well down at the Rose of Tralee well, this year, I, Daniel. I, <laughs> I might have been all right at the Rose of Tralee. But when <laughs> I started here, I realised. It's a different I, kettle of fish, <laughs> I suppose. But Daniel, you know, we watch and we see the progress and all that type of thing. And, you know, we are so behind you here. We're hearing stories of, of Irish people sending money uh, to their friends so they can actually vote for you because, of course, we can't vote from Ireland. So, you know, it must feel brilliant that you've got so many people behind you. Absolutely. And my sister was telling me that the school that I went to at home have pictures up on the wonders, you know, wishing me well and strictly Aww. everybody at the Bill Critch National School for doing that. And everybody, I mean, I've had so many good wishes. It's incredible. I, I never thought that it would get so much uh, publicity and that people would get involved so much. And it's just fantastic. And, mm. and the people in the north, too, have been very much. And, of course, they can vote, so that's tremendous. Oh, that's They're great. Yeah, that's true. Much. We'll all be heading for the border, driving up there and texting <laughs> from there. That'll be my <laughs> thing anyway. Instead of taking the... What's this they used to cross the border to get money with? Yeah, yeah we won't do that anymore. It's true. <laughs> to avoid the customs, it'll be the other way now. It'll be the other way around. <laughs> da Daniel, I met you a few years ago, and I think you were taking Shano's dance classes. Really, was he? Well, uh, actually, we're, we're, we're kind of, I was showing Christina some of the, the steps of a barn dance, so you might see a wee bit of a barn dance. <laughs> if I last long enough, you might see some of that in the future dances on Strictly. I, I don't know whether the judges will appreciate it or not, but we're certainly talking about slipping it in there, and I don't know whether it would go down too well if, or not. Daniel, if, if you forget the steps, that should be your default, <laughs> slip into the barn dance. That's what I do. Daniel, how are you bonding with the other guys? I know, like, Beach Peter Andre is there. Is there anyone specifically that you've kind of get on with? Well, I know you'd get on with everyone, but that you've kind of bonded with? Uh, they're all very, very nice, I must say. We only met, you know, for a few days, but Peter and Ewan, and um, have, I've been sort of in touch with them, and Jay and um, uh, Carl as well. I, yeah. So we didn't exchange numbers with everybody through for no reason other than you know you're sort of through through and with some people more than others and just we're all in the same boat everybody is is nervous even though some of us are used to performing um it, it just doesn't seem to account for anything in this situation yeah. but the other thing that i keep telling myself is that 
I'm not on it because I'm a dancer. I'm on it because I suppose because I sing and that some people know what I do and the dancing is what I'm trying to do. And we're all the same in that respect. Some of them are better than others because they've had a bit of dance and their and their yeah, trip. Yeah. Because they've done theatre and, and, and ba- ballet and all that kind of thing. But um, so Dan- Daniel, I, suppose I, I did go to the Irish club and the Iron and the National and the TV club and all of them. So I should have a wee bit of a. Oh, <laughs> I, I think you do. I mean, before you go, Daniel, you, you have a new album coming out in October. That's right. Yes, I'm doing it, uh, an album called the Hank Williams Songbook. It's all songs oh, that were written or, or recorded by Hank Williams. And, and uh, you're, uh, a ca- you're a cameraman now as well. Yeah. I yeah. am. I hope you're doing I'm the camera. Shaking. You're actually doing your own camera work today. Hope I'm not shaking my hand too much. <laughs> you're not. You're very good. If you're as composed now <laughs> on the dance floor as you are yeah. holding that camera, you'll be grand. <laughs> Daniel, keep in touch with us. We might come back to you after your first dance. If you don't mind, you might talk to us after that. We'd love to talk uh, to you. Thanks very much, and thanks to everybody at home for all their good wishes and I hope that I'll be able to make you feel proud that the steps will be okay. You'll the be steps perfect. will be great. Daniel, good night, Daniel. Lad.